Hallo kijkers van Shine Sprites, welkom bij een gloednieuwe aflevering van Professor Layton en de Miracle Mask. In deze aflevering heb ik, ik had jullie de vorige aflevering laten zitten bij een, uh, bij een uh, eigenlijk een soort van cliffhanger. Maar nu is het eigenlijk een touwhanger, want we hangen aan een touw. We moeten Luke gaan zeven en dat gaan we nu doen. Ik heb natuurlijk even snel gekeken hoe deze, of niet, niet opgezocht, maar eventjes uh, uh, deze puzzel bekeken en ik heb eens gezien hoe die moet. Hij is eigenlijk helemaal niet zo heel moeilijk. Nou, dat was hem. We hebben Luke gered. Just a dash of puzzle solving here. Kijk, hotse flots. We zijn a de beste. Puzzle for a gentleman. Zou het filmpje nu daar verder gaan? Jazeker. I won't be needing this anymore. <laughs> It pains me to see you like this, Randall. Randall? <gasps> But how? <laughs> well, isn't this quite the reunion? Now, my revenge is at hand. Master Randall? Is that really you? It is, unfortunately for you. I have returned to take back everything you stole from me. The Azran treasure, my family fortune, and my Angela. Henry, you will know the pain I have felt all these years. Randall, no! It's not like that! Master Randall, please! You've got it all wrong. Let me explain. Oh, I would love to, but unfortunately, I'm not interested in your explanations. You could at least tell us where you've been all these years. Well, all right. Why not? What good is an untold tale? I first explored the ruins of Akbadai nearly 18 years ago. I was only a few steps from unlocking its secrets before I fell victim to one of its many cunning traps. I fell into a deep ravine, where I could have died. But as fate would have it, an underground river broke my fall. The current washed me onto the banks of a remote village. The villagers nursed me back to health. I made a full recovery, but I could not tell the villagers anything about myself. My mind was a blank. You... you had amnesia? I worked in the village while I tried to recover my memory. Months went by. Years went by. Then eventually I gave up on trying to unearth my old life. Then one day, I received a letter. I know all about your past, it read. I know who took everything from you, and I know how to get it all back. The letter recounted my life in great detail, and it said that the one who had betrayed me was a man named Henry. When I read that name, it was as though someone had turned a key in my mind. Everything came flooding back. I remembered all that I had, and all that had been taken from me. But the letter didn't end there. I have a plan to take revenge on those who have wronged you. You need only to don the garb of the masked gentleman, and they shall cower before you. So it was decided. I would have my revenge by taking back what was mine. And the letters continue. Each one advising me on how to execute my plan as the masked gentleman. 
As each phase of my plan fell into place, I felt myself returning with it. The masked gentleman brought me back. The letters? Professor, do you think... I fear the worst, Luke. This closes my tale of woe. However, we still have a few tears to shed. Henry, you shall bear witness as I ruin you, just as you ruined me. Master Randall, wait! That was Randall. Dat zat natuurlijk wel een beetje aan te komen na, uh, na de vorige aflevering, zeg maar, waar we heel veel van zijn fairy tales kregen, wat heel erg op hem sloeg, maar dan in andere woorden. Uh, dus ik ben benieuwd wat Randall nu gaat, uh, gaat uithalen in The Final Miracle. Randall's gone. Come, we must follow him. Master Randall, how could you think? This last miracle. I wonder what he's planning. Mr. Lador, please allow me to accompany you. Thank you, Mordaunt. We must make Master Randall see the truth before he does something terrible. Quickly, let's go. Uh. Oh, we moeten gewoon uh, de reunion in verlaten natuurlijk. <laughs> I'm so delighted you all could make it. Randall, this is madness. Come down from there. Take a final look around. Henry, you stole everything from me. I treated you like a brother. And this is my reward? Allow me to return the favor. What? The destruction of Monte Dor shall be my final dark miracle! <laughs> Randall, no! What's this? Sam! All that about destroying the town. He's trying to bury us in sand! Professor, we can't stay here! Hmm. Randall, stop this immediately! Why, Herschel? You read you s what you sow, don't you? Watch closely, Henry. Watch your precious city sinks into oblivion. All roads leading out of Montidor have been locked. Embrace the final miracle. Uh, you will all share the fate of your beloved city and return to dust. Ah, wait. It's pouring in so fast. There must be some escape routes we can use, mustn't it? This town is built on an uh, oasis. Uh, and it lies in what is basically a big bowl. If there's no way up, there's no way out. Oh dear, Professor, what can we do? Let me go after Randall, Professor. I can take him down. We must remain calm. Only clear minds will prevail uh, here. Um, we need to head towards the monument. Why? What is over there? I'll explain once we're there. Henry, Angela, come. Understood. We'll follow you to the mon monument. Maybe we can take the tram. Ik zou in dit soort instanties nooit tram kiezen, maar ja. Uh, yeah. Very well. Let's take the tram. <laughs> It's chaos here too. Too. Um, if we don't stop it soon, Montidor will be buried under sand. What are we going to do, Professor? Oi, Leighton, what is this sandstorm? I can't see a thing. Inspector Broski, 
It's it's the masked gentleman, is it? Uh, it should I should have known. Uh, all right, uh, he's got it coming this time for the art. <laughs> Inspector, wait. But here, where he's gone. Has Grosky gone off again? Should have had him tied down. A real loose cannon on deck. Uh, ah, Chief Inspector Sheffield, I need your help. I saw someone dressed like the masked gentleman heading for the gallery plaza. Is that who I think it is? There's no time to explain. We are heading to the monument at once to stop this madness. Please uh, ensure the townspeople are safe. Get everyone uh, to the top floors of the tallest buildings. Hmm, alright Leiden, I'll see you uh, to the people's safety. Is Detective Bloom here? He said he was going to investigate the, uh, the reunion inn. Probably got scared and turned tail once the real trouble started. Don't you worry, uh, we'll sort out the civilians. Um, I'll be waiting in the gallery plaza afterwards. Professor, do you think Detective Bloom really ran away? We didn't see him at the reunion inn. Let's just press on the monument. Web monument. We're here, Professor. Now what? The sand is getting higher. If we only had the Mask of Aura, we uh, would counteract the Mask of Chaos and stop this. Uh, tell us where it is, Henry. What are you talking about, Angela? Uh, this is no time to play dumb. The city is being destroyed. Are you just going to let it happen? Give me the Mask of Aura. I have no idea where it is. Uh, you of all people should know that. Angela, calm down please. The Mask of Order is in a safe place. There's no need to worry. What? How, how do you know that? Professor, we're running out of time. Um, the only thing that can save this town is a true miracle. Uh, professor, what are you talking about? We will now solve the final puzzle of Akbedain. Uh, if my theory is correct, we should be able to save the town. The puzzle of Akbedain? But... What's that got to do with saving the town? The entrance of the ruins is no uh, is nowhere near here, is it, Professor? Correct, uh, but that's just the front door, the visitor's entrance, so to speak. I don't understand. I was quite surprised uh, by that old map of Montidor back in the, at the Reunion Inn. Uh, when I explored the ruins of Akbedain 18 years ago, I made my way to the deepest chambers, but the treasure... Uh, what I found there, um, through worth a great deal in gold, was uh, no great archaeolog of no great archaeological value. Nice. Uh, the treasure was uh, really just another trap led by the Astron to uh, divert thief from the true purpose of the ruins. Uh, anyone satisfied with material riches would fail to look any further and never discover what's really hidden there. And what is that? Henry, you reached the bottom of the ruins as well. Do you remember the markings you saw there? How could I forget? They were like nothing I'd ever seen before. Uh, but I didn't know what they meant. Look at this. What is it? When the Reunion Inn was first built, this area was still an oasis in the desert. Uh, surrounded by ancient ruins. This map shows uh, the lie of the sand before the city of Montidor was established. Using the oasis is the circle center. Uh, do you see how the ruins hint at the shape of the original structures? It's the same shape as those markings. But what does it mean, professor? Uh, it seems the ruins of Aquadine extend uh, for miles underground and end up here, directly below Montidor. Uh, and the heart of the ruins, the deepest chamber uh, that remains hidden for uh, eons, lies directly beneath us. Henry, based on what we read uh, in the expedition journal of in your office, I thought you must know. I just... I never thought... That's amazing, Professor. Uh, if we solve the puzzle of Akbedain, I believe that the hidden chambers will be revealed if, as they once were. 
as they once were. However, uh, in order to do this, we need both masks, the Mask of Chaos and the Mask of Order. I thought I might find you in the eye of the storm. What's going on, Leighton? Uh, where's all this sand coming from? I'm sorry, there's no time to explain, Dalston, but you should know uh, the town is in grave danger. I can see that. The masked gentleman added again. Um, see what happens, Henry. See what happens when you try to sick the police on me for your own gain. Dalston, listen to me. Randall is the masked gentleman. Randall, seriously? Have you finally lost it or is this sand clowning your brain? It's true, Dalston. Randall is alive. Randall? Alive? But how? He's heading for the gallery plaza. We have to stop him. Henry, wait. I'm going with you. But it's just to save the town. Got it? I'll settle matters with you later. Now, let's look uh, for the way into the ruins. According to the map and the markings, it should be around here. Right, let's split up and find it as fast as we can. Er, uh, alright. Hey, over here! Look, that's just a manhole cover. Oh, wait! Look at the spreader! Yes, open it up. Breaking the seal. Each of these stone slabs has two arrows on it. Uh, to open the manhole, um, you must fill the board with slabs so that all four rows, all four columns and both diagonals contain one of each direction of arrow. Uh, some of the slabs are already firmly fixed in place, but you can feel, rot feel free to rotate the rest. Okay. Ah, okay, het is een soort. Hoe noem je zoiets? Een, uh, een soort Sudoku-achtig iets moet je, het, moet je bedenken. Um, deze kan hier. Uh, die kan niet daar, maar die kan misschien wel zo ook niet. Die kan, oh, die kan zo. Dan hebben we nog een naar beneden nodig. Oh nee, naar boven nodig. Zo, dan wordt die denk ik hier. Dan klopt die ook. Um, oh nee, dat kan niet, shit. Dus dat moet een naar boven zijn. Zo, dat kan ook niet. Dit kan ook niet. Zo, kan die zo dan? Ja, dit kan zo wel. Uh, naar boven, naar beneden, naar rechts, een beetje in, in, naar links moet ik dan hebben. Zo. Ja, die kloppen tot nu toe. Zo zou die moeten kloppen. Ja. Top. Just a dash of puzzle solving here. A fine puzzle for a gentleman. Nice. All right, let's go. But what are you planning to do without a mask of chaos, Herschel? I have it right here. What? How? I found it at the Reunion Inn, of course. The true Mask of Chaos, hidden in the archive, just as you as you had left it. I I beg your pardon? Angela hid the mask, Professor? I explain later, we need to act fast if we are to save the town. But what are you planning to do? Yes, even if we have the Mask of Chaos, we still need the Mask of Order, don't we? Not to worry, Luke, I know exactly where uh, that is. Come, Angela, I will need your help.
What is this? This is the final chamber of Akbadine, the one Randall and I never found on our expedition. So what was here all along? Uh, and it, oh, it was here all along. And uh, to solve this room's puzzle, we need both masks. Uh, didn't you say you knew where to find the Mask of Order? Indeed, I will show you. This engraving is the same message that Randall deciphered on the stone tablet years ago. Only the bearers of chaos and order may reveal our legacy. Uh, it, always, it is always the two halves that make the whole. You see those pedestals over there? One mask must be placed on each uh, one of the trigger uh, mechanism. With that, we can unlock the secret of Akbedain and save Montidor. Herschel stops speaking in riddles. Where's the Mask of Order? Hmm, you assume that Henry found the Mask of Order with the treasure that uh, he has been hiding it all along. Assumptions that the dangerous are dangerous, dangerous things. Consider the meshes again. It always the two halves that make the whole. Two halves? No, surely not. And they are united. The bearers of chaos and order shall come. The mask of order has been right here all this time. It was so simple all along. Now, Angela, I need you to help me solve the final puzzle of Akbedine and save Montidor. Yes, Herschel, of course. Spannend! Wind up chamber. Wind up chamber. Four mysterious pillars have risen up. The ruins mechanism, mechanism will activate when the arrows on each pillar point to the center. However, the pillars will only turn if Leighton and Angela step on the uh, opposing buttons at the same time. Uh, when you have Leighton press, uh, uh, press a button, Angela will press the opposite one opposite. Uh, also, keep in mind that they won't be able to press the same buttons twice in a row. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, ik zie het. Maar we hebben het niet gezien. Um. Die. En dan is het eigenlijk die en... D. Nou, was niet zo moeilijk. Hey, Angela. Lekker, Angela. An answer will always appear. Nice. Dat wordt nu boven de What is boven het zand uh, gedeeld. Behold, Randall, the secret of the Azra. I discovered it while you were busy seeking revenge. This ends here.
Oké. Okay. Ja, we save het progress ook nog wel. Epilogue, the city of miracles. Go on, professor. You should talk to Randall. Of course, I have much to say to him. I have to talk to Randall and tell him the truth. This last of the game. We gaan this, dat deze aflevering doen, boys and girls. What was that? What happened? Amazing. Is everyone okay? This is the true treasure of the Azram. The riddle we could not have solved 18 years ago, Randall. We were distracted by tales of fortune, while the most valuable archaeological find lay elsewhere all along. You did it. You solved the puzzle of Akbadai. Spectacular. I must hand it to you, Herschel. There is no puzzle without a solution. You taught me that, Randall. Archaeology was nothing more than a passing fancy for you. And still you unearthed all of this. Incredible. I had some help. Your skill has magnified my own faults. Even in revenge, I am a failure. Nonsense. The important thing is that you're with us now. Master Randall. Stay away from me! You stole everything from me! Everything! That's not true. You still don't see? Henry took nothing from you, Randall. You were used. Used? What are you talking about? Everything you were told in those letters was a lie. What do you mean? The police thought there was someone behind the masked gentleman. They were right. Randall here was merely a puppet. There was someone behind the mask. Pulling the strings all along. And that person is you! <gasps> I wish I could say it's been a pleasure, Descole. <laughs> Well played, Nick. Well played. Descale! And where's Angela? I found Angela trapped in a room at the Reunion Inn. Where is she now? Right here. I asked her to wear a costume while we played Descolet's little game. I see. You pretended to be taken in by my Angela disguise until I helped you solve the riddle of Akbadai. You knew that you needed my help if you were to solve that final puzzle. Very good, Descolet. I knew I never should have used this has been bumpkin. I can't believe what I've done. Your pitiful Ascot. I gave you back your life and you failed. And later, you must tell me. How did you know? When I first arrived here, I spoke to the real Angela. But I definitely sensed a great unease within her. Angela had suspected Randall of being the masked gentleman all along. That was why she wrote me the letter. She was hoping that I would get to Randall before the police did. She thought that if I confronted Randall, I might be able to get through to him. Yes, go on. Despite our history, Angela wasn't sure what I would do if I discovered that Randall was the masked gentleman. But the next time I saw her, there was something different about her demeanor. Her unease had disappeared. And from that moment, I began to suspect Angela. Perhaps I was too eager. 
You gave yourself away when you asked for the Mask of Order to solve the riddle of Oppadine. When I heard of Henry's mask, I needed to find someone to play the masked gentleman. Randall obliged. I had to convince Henry of the power of the Mask of Chaos with our dark miracles. If Henry believed that the Mask of Order could counteract the powers of the masked gentleman, well then, surely he would procure this mask rather than watch his dear city crumble, yes? But when he did not, you grew tired of waiting. You became Angela so that you could get closer to Henry. But Henry still wouldn't reveal the location of the Mask of Order. And he couldn't, because he never had the Mask of Order in the first place. Bravo, mate. But I'm afraid all of the deductive reasoning in the world won't change the fact that I've already won. You've actually done my work for me. What do you mean? This has been a pleasure. Many thanks, Slayton. <laughs> Until next time. Hmm. It works steeds duidelijker. All that time, he was using me. I feel like such a fool. Oh, Randall. Angela. I can hardly believe it. I've been waiting so long for your return. How dare you? You never waited for me. You married Henry. It's not... Traitors! <sighs> After everything I've done for you, Henry, you betray me like this? You stole my ideas and my research. And if that wasn't enough, you stole my love. You couldn't be more wrong, Randall. Henry has been preparing. Preparing for the day you would return home. When I would return? What does that mean? Randall, you should know the truth about Montedor. We have something to tell you. Well, just leave me alone, all of you! Randall, when you disappeared, we didn't know if you'd ever return. We were destroyed. All of us. Your parents took it especially hard, of course. Their businesses failed, and the Ascot House fell into disrepair. All that time, Henry risked his life as he searched for you down in those ruins, but to no avail. In a strange twist of fate, he found the Azran treasure you were searching for all those years ago. Henry supported your parents with his newfound wealth, but he could not truly replace what they had lost. So he did what he could. He worked hard to build Monte d'Or, and he cared for your parents as if they were his own. You... Henry, is this true? It is, Randall. Henry never stopped searching for you. He always believed that you would return someday. He spent a fortune sending search parties down into those awful ruins. He built the Reunion Inn so that they would have a base near the ruins. The Reunion Inn? I believe that was the first building established here in Monte d'Or. Out here, in the middle of nowhere, the Reunion Inn thrived. That was quite a miracle, if you ask me. But not one without a rational explanation behind it. And what was that? Henry announced several rewards for anyone who could find the man named Randall. These rewards were so large that word spread quickly and the Reunion Inn became a popular haunt. From there, the town prospered. Hotels and shops cropped up everywhere. A thriving city bloomed here in the desert and Monte d'Or became the city we know today. I can't believe it. One might say that Monte d'Or is built around the idea of your return, Randall. My return? And that is the true miracle behind the city of Monte d'Or. I... I don't know what to say. Randall, it appeared as if Henry had stolen your family and your fortune. Nothing could be further from the truth. 
In fact, he spent his entire life preserving all that was yours. But Angela... Is... is that my... Randall, my marriage to Henry wasn't real. What? After I lost you, Randall, I didn't know how to go on. My parents kept pressing me to get married. They wanted me to marry the richest man in town, Alphonse Dawson. I had given up so completely by that time that I probably would have agreed just so that they would leave me alone. But then Henry asked me. I'll never forget it. He said, Will you wait for Master Randall with me? Henry always believed you would come back. He helped me believe, too. So we agreed to pretend to be married until the day you returned, Randall. Henry vowed that he would protect and preserve everything of yours. Henry never took anything from you. He protected everything for you. It's a muter. Can it be? Randall. Mother, can it be? Randall. Oh, if it wasn't for Henry, I don't know what would have happened to me. He took such good care of me, Randall. I understand. Oh, Mother. I thought I'd never see you again. Randall, I believe this is yours. This document is proof of ownership for all properties attributed to the Lador family. It reveals that the Lador family fortune is in fact fully owned by a third party. Third party? All of the land and money attributed to the Lador's is actually in the name of Randall Ascot. How can this be? Henry created a replica of the Mask of Chaos, but not to steal the glory that ought to have been yours. It was the symbol of Monte Dor, a beacon that would draw your attention wherever you were. Henry assumed you would seek out someone claiming to have the Mask of Chaos when you came back. His assumption was correct, but when the masked gentleman appeared, it was clear the police would come asking questions. Angela acted fast. She knew that if the police investigated Henry's mask, they would discover it was a fake. So she hid the mask and claimed it had been stolen in order to preserve the symbol of Monte Dor's prosperity. And also to keep Henry's beacon alive. Randall, do you still feel that Henry has taken something from you? What have I done? You weren't yourself. And now that you are, and back here with us, everything is going to be okay. Henry. This was the true miracle all along. Dat waren ze. Wat is dit? Een aftershock. I'm sorry, Herschel. I let you down. I can't pull you up. Now give me your other hand. You can let me go now, Herschel. Randall, you must just give me your other hand, Randall. I can't. I've betrayed so many people. I'll never forgive myself. I don't deserve to live. Let me go. Randall, I can't. Henry. Master Randall, 
After all these years, there's no... there's no way... I'm letting you get away from us that easily. Henry. I'm so ashamed of what I've done. And I don't deserve your kindness or your forgiveness. But why? Why would you do all this for me? Master Randall, do you really not know? You've always looked out for me. That's young Master Randall's toy, not yours. You remember your place. Give that back this instant. Honestly, Henry, I don't know what you're thinking. <laughs> Is this how you were taught? Are you some sort of common thief? I have half a mind to report you to the master. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I just wanted to play with it. Oh, hello. Sorry to disturb you, young Master Randall. Why did you take Henry's toy? Huh? huh? Young Master Randall, I think you're mistaken. This is yours. Mm. Oh. No, this is the robot that I gave to Henry. Now then, if you'll excuse oh. us. Oh, I have half a mind doing? to report you to the master. Oh, all right, I'm going. Hmm. Oh. Master Randall, can you please forgive me for playing with your toy? Henry, it's yours now. But it's your favorite. Uh, well, now it's your favorite. How many toys does one boy need, anyway? Come on, we're going on an adventure today. Thank you, Master Randall. I promise to take care of it and always treasure it. Oh. Let's find some more treasure. What do you say? Hmm. You taught me something invaluable that day, Master Randall. And gave me something to treasure. You treated me not just as an equal, Randall, but also as a brother. And that has always meant more to me than any amount of riches ever could. As the years went by, it became clear to me that our friendship was my most valuable treasure. I'm speechless. There's nothing more to say, Master Randall. We all knew you would return. We just didn't think you'd take so long. Henry. Oh, I'm so sorry. No more apologies. Welcome home. Welcome home. Henry. Angela. I'm home. Tada! Voor deze aflevering heb ik niet zo heel veel voor doen. This was a picture perfect ending. Everything seems to have turned out for the best. Agreed. But I still have lots of questions about the Azran civilization, Professor. I mean, how were they able to build all those structures that were below Montedor? Indeed. I was wondering that myself. The Azran were much more advanced than I'd suspected. Who were the Osron? But Professor, Henry turned out to be an amazing person. He waited so long for his friend to return home, and everything he built was for Randall. It was all quite miraculous. The greatest achievement is often the one that is the most selfless. What other city can claim that it was built on a foundation of loyalty and friendship? None that I know of. Quite fitting. It truly is the city of miracles. And I right there. Ik wil jullie bedanken voor het kijken van deze aflevering en van deze serie. De serie is tot de eind gekomen. Ik wil jullie bedanken. Echt, ik uh, vond het leuk. Oh, nou, tussendoor wordt mijn, uh, wordt, gaat Siri ook nog eventjes uh, afkondigen. Maar echt, bedankt voor het kijken van deze geweldige serie. Misschien wilt u de erfenis van de Asran ook nog wel gaan doen op dit kanaal. Maar dan zien jullie dat vanzelf verschijnen. Bedankt voor het kijken en tot de volgende keer bij een gloednieuwe serie. Adios, amigos.